What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Gamecock Chuck coming at you today. Hey, got a question for all Gamecock Nation. Hey, where do we go from here? Seriously, man, where do we go from here? After watching that debacle uh, Saturday night, you know, that piss poor performance of a football game Saturday night, where do we go from here? You know, um, just like most Gamecock fans, you know, Saturday, Saturday afternoon was a big disappointment. The team came out sluggish, uh, seemed like they was uninspired, didn't know what they were doing. It just, it's just baffling that we're eight games into the season and uh, we still look incompetent on offense. We look lost. It look like we don't know what we got going on, don't know how to run a play. Uh, the playbook itself is just hot garbage, to be honest with you. No creativity, no downfield. Uh, game plan. It's just it's just downright embarrassing if you ask me coming from an SEC program You know, like I said eight games into the season you should you should have an explosive playbook your playbook should be wide open, but From what what I've seen Saturday night. It's just it just isn't there. So like I said, where do we go? You know You mean to tell me on third and 18 our best option is a freaking wide receiver screen Something that hasn't worked all seasons, hardly, and maybe a few times. But third and 18, and you dial up a wide receiver screen. That's just total incompetent, in, um, in my opinion, when it comes to a play caller, to a guy that gets paid a whole lot of money to get the ball in the best player's hands, and he craps to bed, it seems like, every play. Um, there's a lot going on around about Jaheim Bell not getting enough snaps or not playing. DK, where's he been? You know, a lot going on with that, but I mean, it's, come on, man. Come on, Gamecock Nation, answer me. Where, where do we go? I mean, I know there's a lot of Gamecock fans out there. I'm not the only one that's disappointed, that's, that's pissed off right now at the, at the program. I, I know there's a lot of you out there. Let me know your feelings. Let me know what your thoughts are. Let me know what y'all y'all think is the disconnect with this football team. If y'all think it's Satterfield's fault, all Satterfield's fault, let me know. If you think it's the player's fault, let me know. Um, I just wanted to get on here and vent that. I'm, I wasn't too happy with the game. And quite honest with you, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm not putting it, I wouldn't bet against us. I wouldn't bet for us beating Vanderbilt this Saturday, to be honest with you. That's where my head's at right now. It may change as the week goes along, but as of right now, I don't, I don't see us beating Vanderbilt the way we played last Saturday. So, but that's who's next on the schedule and we'll see how it goes. Hopefully the team will play better this Saturday, be more inspired. The playbook will open up. They'll do some more downfield passing or whatever besides some of that uh, bull crap uh, wide receiver screens that seems to never work. So, but hopefully, hopefully we'll get it figured out and uh, beat Vanderbilt and move on, get bowl eligibility and uh, see where we see where we finish on the year. So with that being said, Hey, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like share comment and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you like Gamecock content. Until next time, Gamecock Chuck, I'll see you around.